Yes, what's wrong? Just looked outside the window. It's gonna rain, bro. Rainbows? I love rainbows! No, 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 no. I didn't say rainbows. I said it's gonna rain, bro. I love rainbows. Rainbows are so cool. Yeah, rainbows are cool, but I didn't say rainbows. I said it's gonna rain, bro. Well, you need rain in order for it to make a rainbow, bro. 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 Let's learn about rainbow. Ah, I mean rainbows. Rainbows can be seen in mist, fog, during or after it rains, and even in dew. Rainbows always will show up on the opposite side the sun is shining. If you have ever worn sunglasses and saw the sunlight, you might think that the light looks white, right? But it isn't actually white light though. It is actually a bunch of different colors. In fact, all the light from the sun is actually all the colors we see in a rainbow, which we're going to learn about a little later in this video. So why do we usually just see white light? It's a good question, Quinn. We actually see the light as white because it is not passing through anything. But if the rain is falling or immediately after the rain stops and the sun is shining, the sunlight bends or refracts as it shines through the water in the air. And this bending or refraction allows us to see the actual colors of the sun in a rainbow. But we cannot see the rainbow unless we are somewhere between the sun and the rain. So. How are rainbows formed? Good question. Let's find out. Rainbows usually appear from rain, but they can also happen wherever light is refracting inside of water droplets. You see, when it rains, millions of raindrops make the colors in the white light separate and refract. And hey, guess what? Believe it or not, every raindrop makes its own little rainbow. But when there are millions and millions of raindrops at the same time, the rainbows become big enough for us to see from the ground to the sky. Water and other materials in the air curve the different colors at different angles, which is called dispersion. By breaking up into separate colors, rainbows look colorful, even though the source of light hitting them is white. Hey, guess what? Rainbows are made up of seven colors. These colors are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. An easy way to remember these colors is think of the name Roy G. Biv. That's a rainbow's best friend, Roy G. Biv. Want to learn something really cool about rainbows? Did you know that no two people see the same exact rainbow? That's right, Gus, because everyone sees something different because it all depends on how the light is being refracted and then reflects back to that specific person. Can you touch a rainbow? I bet you a lot of people are wondering that same question, Quinn. Rainbows are not a physical object or something that can be touched like a toy or a book. As we learned, rainbows are made up of light that is reflected and bent. So just like when you see light, you cannot touch that either. Hey, guess what? Did you know there is no end to a rainbow? Even though they look like an archway or an upside down U, rainbows are actually a circle. But we can only see some of the circle because we can only see the rainbow from the round. And did you know that there are actually nine different types of rainbows? The nine common types of rainbows are primary rainbow, double rainbow, twinned rainbow, full circle rainbow, 
supernumerary rainbow, reflected rainbow, monochrome rainbow, higher order rainbow, and fogbow? Hmm, that's a lot of different types of rainbows. Out of all of those, a primary rainbow is the most common type of rainbow that you've probably seen. A double rainbow happens when the light refracts and reflects off the water drops in the air two times. And what this means is that the second rainbow is a reflection of the first rainbow. And this second rainbow is also lighter in color and the colors are actually reversed. If you see a double rainbow, you will also see the sky between the two rainbows is dark and without light. This is called Alexander's Band. And hey, guess what? Did you know that some rainbows can form at night? And this is called a moonbow, but it is very, very rare to see. And rainbows can happen during any season, winter, spring, summer, or fall. All you have to do is call. I don't think she knows that song, Gus. Anyway, it's actually very rare to see them during the winter because in the winter, raindrops freeze and turn into snowflakes. So fewer raindrops are seen and fall to the ground. Hey Gus, do you know what state has the most rainbows? Mm -hmm, I don't know. Tell me. It is the state of Hawaii. Hawaii? Oh, Hawaii? Oh, wow. So, when you take all the information that you learned about in this video, I'm sure you'll agree. Rainbows are really pretty special. Well, hey, guess what? Now we all know more about rainbows. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. It really helps out our channel. Yes, it does. Make sure you subscribe. Bye. Bye.